What is you guys? It's Warrior. Welcome back to RDM Vlogs. Now, guys, we have reached Kuala Lumpur and we are here at KL Tower, which is all the way up there, 421 meters up high. And we're gonna go explore the place, obviously. Let me try to get the focus up. We're gonna explore the place, but we've got this like, upside down thing as well. So the house there is upside down. Um, but we're gonna go explore the entire place and you guys know me. I'm gonna bring you guys through the entire experience. You go all the way up there, it's 421 meters. And yeah, let's go. So we obviously we're greeted by this nice, very nice entrance. We parked our car at the back actually. We walked all the way up front. We're gonna go up and through and up there. And I'll show you guys snippets of the entire process. And the next time I'll talk, I'm not sure when, but I'll see you guys in a bit. The entrance is brilliantly done with the artificial patch. It makes the flooring very nice to walk on. Honestly, I've been here once when I was a very young kid, so I don't remember anything at all. So whatever we see today, it's going to be like a first impression kind of thing. And that's the Minara Tower right there, or the Mendeka Tower right there, and obviously the Queen Tower. Which we'll go through tonight, so you guys will be able to see that as well. And yeah, the weather's brilliant. The vibes are immaculate. So let's see how this goes. So we've got the tickets. Alright. It's not for this ticket, I'm just here on your right side. Alright, thank you. So we've got a ticket. We got a queue on the right side. So that's exactly where we're gonna go. Go, go. Uh, that's my uncle. My mom went up to the front. Go, go, go. So they do kind of a final check before we actually are allowed to get in and I'll see you guys on top. Yep. And here we have finally reached the observation deck. It's his first time. It's my first time to so see. Obviously we come out with like washrooms out here. But the best thing you want to see, the best thing you do not want to miss out is this. We've got views. On views, check it out. So obviously that's the Medega Tower right there. And then you guys can see there's a little stadium there as well. Brilliant views. And there's also like a little souvenir shop right here. And if you guys use the binoculars, I am sure you'll be able to see something far, far away. And right there, over there you see. A little building area right there. That's the king's house, the king's palace, right there. You guys can see that too. It's all of its entirety. Which is brilliant. And we're gonna go continue. So obviously there's like our rules of surveillance as well. See if you guys want to buy something to eat, to buy dinner, kind of got to give people and stuff. You guys can do it that too. And here we've got more buildings, obviously KL. It's a ton of buildings. Um, and then over there, that's the um, Twin Tower, Twin yeah, Times Square, sorry. That's, that's the Times Square right there. The red building right there. And I've got more. We have more. So, so obviously it's a 360 degree, it's a, it's a circular deck, right? So you can do like a one hole. You can have, you can take a one hole round. And the views are just different. You guys can see the mountains in the rear and right there. And you obviously know, ton of buildings, construction everywhere. And obviously. Being what it is, being the CBD and everything, it's just brilliant. And 
it is never ending so we're gonna actually try to shoot a couple of parts here and there here is where it gets interesting because there there's a twin tower right there check it out so yeah the patronus which we will go tonight and i'll bring you guys there as well um just the lights there at night it's immaculate pristine almost in just buildings all around just never-ending buildings all around it's almost like a fairy tale ish kind of thing check it out We've got a very nice building right there. And then got another like tall building out of nowhere. Bunch of buildings, hotels, offices, banks, everything, you name it. They got it. And so far we're only halfway through the entire circle, so it's gonna be a while. And here is the Modeca Tower. I can show you guys. One of the highest, if not the highest building in Malaysia. I see it goes all the way up to the top right there. Pretty brilliant. The views are amazing. And here we've got a, a wall of fame. We've got me at the back. And then from here, I'm actually going to do a bit of exploring on my own. I mean, we are more or less done. But from here, we'll, I'll see you guys in a bit. And before we leave, I just wanted to show you guys our hotel. Let me try to find it because I, I lost it. Oh, there it is. I just want to show you guys my hotel. It's right there. Just this little building right there. And I think I was on the 8th floor somewhere over there. But it's crazy how small it looks like from here. There's a couple. Oops. My dad enjoying the view. There's views for days, just never ending views. But yeah, we haven't actually hit out, I think. So I've walked like four rounds around this place already. Can head on out? You know, explore. A couple more places. And when I do, when I reach there, I'll see you guys later. Before we leave, we gotta get some chicken shawarma. It's, it's actually right outside the venue, which I think makes it that much more convenient. Everyone's waiting, everyone's hungry. Yeah, we're gonna have some chicken shawarma right there. And then we're gonna make a move. And we are here. We drove across to the the Petronas Twin Tower. This is the shopping mall by itself. We try, we're trying to like, figure out a way to get out of here and look at the exterior portion. That's her. Yeah, we still gotta find our way, so I'll, I'll figure the way out first and then I'll bring you guys back in. And boom, we've made it out, guys. We've made it out. And uh, there used to be a water fountain ish around, along the whole stretch here, but uh, they kinda, I think, shut it off for some reason which kind of i feel like has also left a lot of people just standing on here taking weird photos i mean come on man it's a, i don't know man i mean it's supposed to be a nice place but it's like it's overcrowded and it's like i, don't know, I feel like it's a bit abused to a certain sense but yeah hold and behold hold and behold petronas twin tower in all of its glory it's brilliant everything around here is just nice the, it's not too hot today. It's not stuffy as well. It's a very calm, chill weather, peaceful as well. So I think that's nice, nicely done. And yeah, check it out. Petronas Twin Tower. And that's also gonna be my thumbnail, I think. So we're gonna go, I asked you to obviously explore the place a little bit more. But there's just a lot of people today. It's a weekday, it's Thursday. Time now is 5.54 on a, on a Thursday evening. It's just an influx of people. But once again, guys, check that view out. We've got views on views. Check it out. And the timing could have been impeccable. Finally started. Water fountain. Check it out. Now you see my uncle. Smock self is a visual. Everyone's just waiting, waiting, chilling. It's, kind of, it's getting hot oh, for some reason, it's actually getting quite hot. So I'm just. Let's go. And before we leave, we actually came to the back of the Twin Tower. Here, apparently, they have like a nice water show. 
right there as you guys can see so there's one ongoing right there and then apparently at night it lights up and it illuminates and stuff but i don't think we'll stay for that long um so we're gonna go explore a couple other places here in kuala lumpur because tomorrow even, even though we are gonna be here we're actually gonna drive out to Genting, so we're gonna spend the night there or the day there to say that this but yeah sun so the sky is a bit cloudy as well and this is my uncle I, I was still enjoying you know my dad just taking photos of the photos look at him look at him guys the hustle is real the workload is real now this is my mom but yeah from here we're gonna drive out now and then i'll see you guys in the next destination and we are here at you guessed it stana negara which is the king's house and we found, it, found out about this place the previous time we were in KL and I think the reason why is because this gate is gigantic, it's massive, it's beautiful and I think the place itself looks brilliant and uh, if you remember, we were there we were there at the Minara and we actually saw, if you guys remember we actually saw the place that's how brilliant it was, I mean imagine having such a nice place it's brilliant, you know and uh, for future plans from here on out, I don't know what we're going to do. I'm not really sure if you're going to go explore any other places or what. But if you do or not, I'll, obviously uh, you guys will be able to see in a couple of seconds. But for me, it's going to be a well. So whatever we do, I'll see you in a bit. And we're going to have a lot, lot for dinner right here. And we are going to sit down right here. And... This is a hotel right here. I was I think I was about but well, I was I was somewhere there. But uh we've always seen this, we've never tried and then now we know what lot lot tastes like. We were like, you know what, let's give this a shot. So we're gonna sit down here and dive right straight into dinner. So guys, we have the other video. It's end of day two. Uh, we did, we explored a bit of Chinatown and then we walked around a little bit. But I didn't film much because there wasn't anything for me to film. My parents went in to get some dinner at Texas Chicken. And once that's done, we're gonna go back to the hotel. We're gonna have a quick dinner. And we're gonna call it off at night. But just like guys, let me know if you in the comments if you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more of such content, I'll see you tomorrow. This video is over and I'm out. Peace.